the most notorious murder case of the 20th century. It's the controversial new six-part documentary on the O.J. Simpson case, claiming, get this, that O.J. may be innocent. Is O.J. Innocent? The Missing Evidence is produced by actor Martin Sheen, and it's causing an uproar. It actually claims that Simpson may not have murdered his wife, Nicole, and her friend, Ronald Goldman. How long would you be able to detect blood in that sheath? One of the investigators on the series is Derek Lavasser, and you may recognize him. <laughs> Lavasser is a Rhode Island cop who won Big Brother in 2014. What do you say to people who say, oh, this guy's from Big Brother, how does he have any credibility? On this show, my focus is 100 times more concentrated than it was on Big Brother, and now you're seeing me in my element. This is what I do every day. I've been doing it for 13 years. So if Simpson didn't do it, as most people believe, then who did? The documentary airing on Investigation Discovery points a finger at O.J. Simpson's son, Jason, as a person of interest. Jason, now 47, is said to have had a stormy relationship with his stepmother, Nicole. Allegedly, Jason Simpson was the one that committed the murders. Uh, based on some a tumultuous relationship between him and Nicole um, that ultimately led to him confronting her. There was a mountain of evidence against OJ and almost nothing against anyone else. What if there was a second person there but they never actually entered the crime scene? What if they stayed in the car? There wouldn't be as much trace evidence found in the actual crime scene because of it. Bill Deere, a private investigator involved in the show, claims to have discovered the long-lost murder weapon, a knife, which he says was Jason's. This was found in our suspect's storage facility. It's designed for one purpose, to cut and to kill. The markings that Nicole sustained on her scalp came from the butt of this knife. But critics say the theory behind the documentary is nonsense. Among them, Prosecutor Marsha Clark. What is he going to do? Say it's not me, it's my dad? You know, and what a hideous thing for them to do. I, I just can't even tell you how awful it is, and it's baseless. Prosecutor Marsha Clark calls this whole theory of O.J. being innocent ludicrous, baseless. What do you say to her? This is still an open case. We have a responsibility as an investigator to take everything we have and, and vet it, if it's true or not. And this is part of the process. Is, you know, we have a, a responsibility for these victims to try to give them closure. And Tom Lang, the retired LAPD lead detective on the case, says he has no doubt that O.J. Simpson is guilty and no one else. There's nothing exculpatory in this case. It all points at Simpson.